All right, so this is an update to the uh, gal gun fix. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to go back to the initial settings and change everything to default values. And then from there, we're going to change everything to what we need to to make sure the fix works for everyone as far as I'm aware. Now, I did the test using both my gaming desktop, which has the NVIDIA GeForce 1060 6 gig model, the i5-2320 rated at 3.2 gigahertz, overclockable to 4.2, somewhere along those ranges, 16 gigs of RAM. And then on my laptop, which is a Dell Vostro 15, which upgraded to having 16 gigs of RAM, has an AMD video card built in, or integrated graphics card, I did the thread state. Uh, test, which made it so that the 1-2 crash did not occur. So, without further ado, let's actually get into everything we need to do to make sure that this game does not crash for anyone. So, the very first thing we want to do is we want to navigate to... The Steam Library folder, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Galgun, Double Piece, GG2G Game, or GT2 Game, Config. And we want to go to Default Engine. Alright, so let's take a look at the Default Engine INI file. <clears throat> Alright, so with the default engine INI file loaded up, we can see the configuration. So we need to scroll down a bit, past cores.system, down to engine.engine, .engine, language, int, b enable color clear, true, b smooth frame rate, true, minimum smooth frame rate, switch that to 30, minimum smooth frame rate, switch it to 30. And the reason we're doing this is because this game was released on console first. So this was a port, which means that they probably did not optimize the game. Well, we already know they didn't optimize the game. But they did not optimize for PC, which is able to surpass frame issues that consoles have. So let's lock it at the same frame rate that consoles have, which is 30 frames per second. Let's save this bad boy. And now, let's move on to the next step. What we want to do is right-click on Galgun Double Piece, go into the Properties. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to set the launch options for this bad boy. There we go. And the launch options is fairly simple. What we're going to do is dash one thread. Click OK, and we're good to go here. So now we can actually All play right, the game now without. Let's any play the game and do the test. And we're going to go with the common route 1 2 expert since that's the save file. So that way we don't have to play the whole beginning of the game to test. All right, so let's do the entrance. We'll do this as quickly as possible. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Done. Done. Da 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 da. All right. Done. Up. Done.
Got the rare photograph. Got that. Boom. Got her as she dropped. That was beautiful. Oh, that was another one I just forgot. Got her. 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 Game set match. <clears throat> wow, that was fast. I should have gotten a good grade. A G grade on that, really? Hmm. F grade. Okay. Alright, so. Moment of truth. We'll speed through that. <clears throat> yeah, 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 yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, yeah. I know. And. Booyah. Now you can choose between. Of course, you have to beat the game in order to unlock the different options. Shinobu. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. Speed through. Speed through. I'm gonna be able to exit the game now. Uh huh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 blah. And yes, I do have a cold. Uh. Alright, so wink at her. Boom. All right, and now we can exit the game. All right, and as the outro, I'm just going to leave the full instructions here. Navigate to your Steam library, Steam, Steam apps, common, Galgun, double piece, GG2 game, config. Inside the default engine.ini file, change minimum smooth frame rate 32. Max smooth frame rate 62 to uh, minimum smooth frame rate 30, maximum smooth frame rate 30. Save the file. Next, right click on Galgun and click on properties. Set the launch options to be one thread, dash one thread specifically. And no matter what system you have, whether it's a laptop, whether it's a desktop, whether it's powerful, whether it's not, it should run the game. Alright, this has been the Rising Phoenix Dev, and I'm signing out. I'm going to go to sleep now.